is the Bluegrass Cafe here at 91.7 WHUS Stores, whus.org. My name is Amy Orlamoski, and we're going to start off with a song from a California musician by the name of Matt Dudman. You may be familiar with Matt from his other recording that we've played here at WHUS over the years, a very traditional uh, album called Matt and George and Their Pleasant Valley Boys. And uh, this new record from Matt is his first solo one, and it has the title of Poa. We're going to listen to the first single off of that recording right now. It's called One Short Year. Well, it's all over town. How you been running around? You stay out every night till two or three. Matt Dudman with a brand new song called One Short Year on the Bluegrass Spatial. Alex Leach in here with you. It's East Tennessee Zone 899 WDVX FM Clinton, Tennessee. Matt Dudman and One Short Year. I'm Mike Keir and this is music from Foggy Hollow. Uh, I'm pretty certain that album is going to be a good one too when it finally when it's finally done and when it comes out. It's a Northern California band led by Dixon's Matt Dudman with a song from Matt's forthcoming album. One Short Year was written by the guitar player and lead singer Paul Squires. Matt plays mandolin and bass, sings it, and produced it at his Pleasant Valley Studios with fiddler Ed Neff and Sandy Rothman playing banjo, completing the quartet. My name is Peter Thompson, and it's always a pleasure and a privilege to bring the music to you. But I know they're waiting by the fireside for one kids to return This is 91.7 WHUS Stores. It's time to open up another COVID-19 edition of our Bluegrass Cafe. We're going to listen to a uh, song from that collection here at WHUS and my Louisiana home. Well, I want to go home to old Louisiana. The set began with Dixon's own Matt Dudman with a song from his forthcoming album. Guitar player and lead singer Pat Flory wrote My Louisiana Home. Matt Tenor's Pat sings lead on the verses in addition to playing both mandolin and bass. Sandy Rossman's the banjo player and the twin fiddles are by Ed Neff and Sneed Hearn. My name is Peter Thompson and it's always a pleasure and a privilege to bring the music to you. Go his This is KKUP Cupertino 91.5 FM, and it's time for Monday Night Bluegrass. My name is Dave Bob Nielsen. I've got something new from Matt Dudman at Pleasant Valley Music. He's up on the Highway 80 corridor there, and he uh, has a recording studio, and he does some pretty fine bluegrass. And I've got a new CD from him that uh, I got this last week, and let's, uh, let's see what it sounds like. Blues that make you want to cry The kind that makes you want to lay down and die The way you feel when she said goodbye That's blues that the baby gave to me um, Matt Dudman That's brand new from him I, I trust that's going to be part of a, a CD in the future And this is KKUP Cupertino 91.5 FM. I saw a brave and trembling motorman Who said his age was 21 Saw him step down from the motor Crying, Lord, what have I done?
everyone knew it was all in the clear. Everyone knew it but me. I'm Mike Keir, and this is music from Foggy Hollow. We're coming to you today from Sydney, Australia, through Hawkesbury Radio 89.9 FM. We're also heard on great radio stations like BluegrassCountry.org in Washington, D.C. This week in music from Foggy Hollow, the new releases Bluegrass Show, new singles from Lonesome River Band, Sacred Reunion, and Matt Dudgman. Now, Matt Dudman sent me some uh, sent me music. He said, I, I, I think, it, it, you know, would you listen to my, my music and... See if you know if you like it. Would you play it? And I said, Well, if I like it, I will. Yes, I will. So he sent me the music, the first single from his new album, Poa, on Pleasant Valley Records. Here's Matt Dudman and uh, his brand new single. We started with Matt Dudman, brand new from him, a tune from his forthcoming recording, and it has the title of POA, P-O-A. Do you know what that means? Okay, I'm going to tell you, because I didn't know either. It is actually the scientific name for Kentucky bluegrass, believe it or not. It's called POA pretensis. That is where the name comes from. They kind of shortened it and just called the album POA. Very clever. And that is it for this week's edition of our Bluegrass Cafe here at WHUS. Hope you've heard something you've enjoyed at some point this afternoon. Until then, everybody, have yourself a great week. Take good care. Stay healthy. We will see you somewhere down the line. Every day. 